This episode of Loose Beats is brought to you by ExpressVPN. Hide your shit, hide your wives. And also brought to you by Real Bird Entertainment Apparel for your heady expression. Check out the links below in the description. What is up and welcome to Loose Beats, where our motto is chill out and make a beat. I'm Toby, a.k.a. Cushing, from the TND channel. Make sure you check out everything we do. And today, I got this new beat that I wanted to show you how I like to use vocal synth and vocoder over. So we'll go ahead and get this uh, intro into the drop, and then we'll start breaking it down. You know know how we do? All right, let's get that. From them, but everybody wanna know you love them Try to stay at above them But every opposition try and dub in Some other narrative I don't approve of Fuck your heritage, that fuck your parents Shit is so embarrassing to find a new love Real fam, call it new blood I might put you on, I might put you under Grab a couple yarns, if the shit tomorrow You can see me then, yeah I'll try and fit you in Now the 7.30 sound, whoop, got it booked just now Better luck next week so you see uh we got this nice little uh western beat that turns into a hip-hop thing and it's got a cool little feel to it uh not for me you know not just not an average kind of thing but uh so just starting to break it down first of course we got this uh guitar coming in it's uh in the move the mics uh amp and combo amp combo kind of thing and let's go ahead and check out kind of what that sounds like. So we got these these D's and these F's and a B flat and an A. And uh, it's basically just, you know, those Western. That kind of shit. It's kind of like that, but it's walking down like with a waltz, right? So. So it's walking down real nice. It's got that Western feel, which I like. Uh, Don't use that often, but it comes out pretty cool when you can get it. And so we start with that. We bring in the vocals first, and then we got uh, a beat that slowly comes in. We got this Blue Ridge, which is just under your drum kits, not your electronic drum kits, which uh, just, you know, sound more organic. And so that one's just coming in basic. You know, we're just trying to introduce our rhythm, basically. Yeah, I got little toms in there. Uh, Got that really tight hi-hat. And uh, then we come in with a few other things. We come in with this other uh, electronic drum kit, Atlanta. And it's going to do some more of our hi-hats. It's going to do our stutters, little uh, things on the snare, you know. Just to hear it alone. And it's got a nice little boppy feel to it, you know. That's just cool. And that, you know, adding, I've been doing that a lot recently using a regular drum kit with an electronic drum kit just to kind of mix up the feel of it. And it really brings out the uh, full sound, you know, when you use two different kits. And so I got, the only thing I have on this, I left the auto filter, the envelope or everything they had on. And then I added this phaser and just pulled the out down a little bit, pulled her mix back a little bit. I think I left everything alone. Uh, other than that, so it's just their standard phaser setup. But that drums going through the phaser or a flanger is pretty nice. Because a lot of people like... Uh, work on getting their hi-hats to be kind of moving and pitch as well and the phaser kind of imitates that you know it uh, it's not actually changing the pitch necessarily but it's uh, changing the eq and kind of tightening and loosening up the sound so it actually does kind of sound like it's moving a little bit and um, let's see with this atlanta we bring in this thumb bass which you know is one of my favorite 
uh, regular sounding basses. Just doing our steps. Yeah. And so not much to say there, you know, we just need that thick, uh, that bass sound back there to bring up that melody. And so then we got um, this wobbly electric piano, which uh, it's a nice little kind of whirly sound. And so just to go ahead and start on how we're breaking, going to break down these vocal synths, um, basically... We got, uh, I start out with this D minor, and uh, so I have them walking up the same way that they are on the guitar, right? So it's just kind of a. You know, so it's, uh, gets the same kind of waltzy feel to it, you know, just kind of adding uh, to the tone of the guitar by adding that. And so with that, you know, that's our basic setup of a beat. We've got our vocals here, which are, you know, they're half mixed, just like everything I show you guys. And uh, what I wanted to do is I want to bring in this vocal synth. So there's, uh, you know, there's a few different vocoders that are going to be good to use and this is just the one that i have found that i like the most and it's isotopes vocal synth but it's a basic vocoder and we got a couple other uh different kind of tones you can use but so i've got it set up and what you're going to need to do in any vocoder if you're using logic is just run your side chain or whatever is feeding you information you're going to run that to the track that you've already recorded or the one that you're doing live either way and so you've got that, make sure to have it if you're using vocal synth on this MIDI mode. And uh, you can start to try out different sounds and you can start to work on your melody. So let's hear the vocals and see how really it's coming through. I from them, but everybody want to know you love them, try to stay out above them. But every opposition trying to dub in Some other narrative I don't approve of Fuck it, Harry, this shit, fuck your parents Shit is so embarrassing to find a new love Real fam call it new blood I might put you yeah, on so, I might You know, that's a standard setup Uh, This, let's see uh, I think it's under Angelic Voices, something like that This preset uh, with a vocoder And a compivox But um so basically, here's where I run into some different ideas of like, um, that's me playing the structure uh, the same way I did this uh, Wurlitzer up here. It's wobbly. And uh, so hear that, hear me playing the actual chords as you would on a piano, just like a one, three, five kind of setup. Uh, and hear how it sounds. I ain't really getting out from them, but everybody wanna know you love them. Try to stay out above them. But every opposition trying to dub in some other narrative I don't approve of. Not bad. You know, it's, uh, it's not bad, but it kind of sounds a little typical to me, you know? Um, and so I like to test that out. I like to try, you know, you can always go the route, we can go the Collier route, Jacob Collier, and like finding its relative notes and and really experimenting with your movement inside of the vocoder, right? But basically, if you do just want to follow the melody, which typically, unless you know theory really well, is going to sound the best if you just actually follow along, the only change that I would make is playing this the second arrangement, this type. Uh, so instead of this D minor, you're going to be playing this one. With that, uh, your root note's going to be your fifth, right? And this is actually how it's played on the guitar. If you count it out, um, the arrangement isn't played like a one three five on a piano. And uh, it tends to match up a little better. It tends to change the the kind of sound of it, right? Just because you're not hit, starting with your root note. So you're kind of getting the feel of playing your relative key, but with while staying in the chord right so 
this seems to be like a good way to approach uh, the vocoder, right? So we're gonna, I'm gonna jump in here and uh, see if we can record a little idea of just me moving along uh, with the chords and see how that comes out. Are you really getting out of from them? But everybody wanna know you love them Just stay ahead above them And every opposition trying to dub in Some other narrative I don't approve of Fuck your heritage, shit, fuck your parents Shit is so embarrassing, we find a new love Real fam, call it new blood I might put you on yeah, I so might put you That's just pretty much following the steps along with the guitar And uh, without nothing crazy added um, we're going to go ahead and see how that would sound. Hey, you really getting out of from them, but everybody want to know you love them. Try to stay ahead above them, and every opposition trying to dub in. Some other narrative I don't approve of. Fuck your heritage, so fuck your parents, shit is so embarrassing. We find a new love, real fam, call it new blood. Yeah, so I do like how that turned out. It has... Uh, you know, there's subtle variations you can make, you know, like I hit this one a little late and uh, you can kind of change when you uh, are switching your notes. You know, you're still in key. You can kind of fuck around with it. You don't have to be exactly following whatever instrument you're on. But um, let's see how that sounds with the beat. Uh, I have a feeling that it might be OK. Let's try it out. Yeah. So, yeah, I like how that turned out. This is just a simple way to get in and uh, get those chords, get that vocal synth in the background, and uh, get that vocoder sound really simply. I'm going to go ahead and double this up. And uh, we're going to use it for the second half as well. Uh, should be okay. Again, if you want, you want to go through and, you know, the more, compli the more complex it is, as long as it's in key, it's going to sound better, right? But uh, this is just a good place to start. And so I'm going to double that up for our next half. You know, it's the same arrangement, so it should work fine. And uh, I think this is going to come out nice, you know. I was about to start doing this, and I was about to start working through uh, some very odd arrangements and then I was like you know what like let me just try to get it basic and see how it sounds and it sounds way better I think just to start here and you can go in and you can add you know little sevenths ninths whatever if you uh, feel so inclined you know but that's pretty much it you know I just wanted to show the approach that I start uh, with my vocal synth my vocoder stuff like that and uh, I hope this was helpful at all Hope you like the beats. Make sure to check out everything else on the page. Check out our Patreon. Uh, check out our new sponsor, uh, VPN. Express VPN. Um, you know, fuck. Uh, our new sponsor, Express VPN. You can find our link. We got our own Toby Davy link below. So, you know, make sure to check out that. And uh, hit me up if you like some beats. You know, do whatever you want with your life. This is your life. And show us some love if you can. Like, subscribe, check the shit out. Love you guys. And we're going to go out on this vocoder song.